One of the most effective tools for behavior change is what's called implementation intentions or when-then plans. Basically, it goes like this. In a certain situation, a certain circumstance, a certain trigger, when X, then Y, and Y is what I'm going to do in response. So if I'm coaching someone around constantly interrupting in meetings, when someone else speaks, then I will let them finish, take a breath, before I respond. If I'm coaching someone on a health behavior, when I feel the urge to eat chocolate, I will drink a glass of water and give myself 10 minutes to decide if I really want it. And these implementation intentions, these when then plans can become rules by which we live so that we can live into behaviors that serve us, that serve our best interests. The problem is though, some of us are rule breakers and we think of ourselves as rule breakers, as people who don't like to follow any kind of rule. Like, hey, that's gonna cramp my style. Any rule that is imposed upon me or that I think I have to impose upon myself just feels like some, something is superimposing something on me, taking away my autonomy, taking away my control. And as soon as I hear a rule, I just get the urge to break it. So what do we do? If that's you, if you want to change a behavior and we can come up with here's the moment in which you are going to engage in either the old behavior that moves you away from what you want or the new behavior that moves you towards what you want. And we want to establish that there is some means of going there. And what do we do if the minute you think of a rule, you immediately want to break it? Well, the thing is, you're already following a rule. If you're interrupting people in meetings, you may have a rule that says, whenever I hear something that I disagree with, I have to jump in and interrupt. Or it might be, whenever I get excited in a conversation, I have to speak immediately, depending on the type of interrupting you're doing. And that is a rule. And it's not a rule that you necessarily have set out for yourself. But if you have a behavior that you are following, even though it's getting in your way, even though it's stopping you from accomplishing what you want to accomplish, even though it's not in your best interest, you are doing it because of an unconscious rule that you have been conditioned to follow and you are following without flexibility, without choice. So how about that? You're already following a rule and you're following a bad rule. If you feel like you have the preference for chocolate, you think about chocolate, and you immediately need to go open a bar of chocolate and eat chocolate, you're following a rule. When I have a preference for chocolate, I must have chocolate. It's unacceptable for me not to eat it when I have the preference. So we're already following rules. So if you find that you are averse to creating a new rule, then at least write out what your old rule is. And you know your old rule based on your behaviors. Look at the behaviors and say, what is the rule that these behaviors are expressing? If this, then that. When this, then that. Write it out and decide, is that a rule you want to follow all the time, 100% of the time, with zero flexibility, with zero choice? And if you're a rule breaker, you're probably going to get outraged. And you're probably going to be very upset that that's a rule that has you by the short and curlies. And you're going to want to break that rule. So now the question is, how do you break an old rule? And the answer is you give yourself the flexibility to do something else. So those implementation intentions we talked about earlier, that when then, the good when then, simply becomes an option. So now when you're in that situation, you can think about, do I want to follow the old rule or do I have the flexibility to choose between the old rule and the new one, between the old way of being and the new way of being, between the old behavior and the new behavior? And simply saying, I want the flexibility to choose and taking a moment to say, well, what outcome do I want? Will then allow you to choose the outcome that's the behavior that's going to get you that outcome. So instead of being rule bound, you are rule freed. Give it a try. Let me know what you think. Have a great day.